channel you'll see the vlog I said I was coming up to AC to meet my fellow youtuber slash friend and let's see if your guesses were right this is Jason he has a YouTube channel I've shouted him out before and this is him in the flesh this is me in the flesh yes hello everybody <laughs> now, so what is your YouTube name I'll link um, it down below it took us about 20 minutes because he forgot his name no I'm just kidding what is your YouTube <laughs> Yes, I did forget my <laughs> channel name just for a little while there. Um, He's nervous, that's why. <laughs> I had filming with my YouTube inspiration. Oh, so, stop. Um, it's Fosse Bear, F O S S E B E A R, like Bob Fosse, because I work on Broadway. So. Yeah, I will leave it down below for you guys. Check him out. He does unboxings. He does some cooking videos. Sometimes he vlogs. He's my neighbor. He lives in New York. So you vlog what? The uh... Which vlog are you referring the, the, to? The park. Oh, Central Park. Yeah. <laughs> Central He's done park. Central yes. Park. Yes. I did do that. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm, I promise you, we have not been drinking. We have not drank, but you know what? He, is, me, and him are so much alike, and he's. It's. So, I had nothing but a good time, really. He is this way on camera that he is in, in real life, and I, I've really, I've had a good time. So we look a mess, really quick. I didn't even tell you what this, what this, uh, what this uh, video is about. We are going to be doing a Gerard Cosmetics mystery box, but I want to tell you a quick story. We wanted to get some ice and some soda. We are on the 46th floor. We go down to the vending little air, you know, down the hallway. The ice machine does not work, nor does the soda machine. So we go down the second floor. The ice machine works, the soda does not work. We go down two floors. Well, they only take Cash. Yeah, they only take cash. So we had to go get some, we had to come back and get cash and go all the way back down because they didn't take the card. So. It was quite an adventure. Yeah. This is why, like one of those moods, you know, it, we had a good time. We should have been filming that. All right, now really quickly, this was sent to me by Gerard Cosmetics. However, I had it for a couple weeks and it was when they were doing their um, Christmas in July. But I haven't got a chance to film. Actually, as I'm filming this, I don't think I put a video up in like eight or nine days. So you can no longer get this anymore, but I thought it would be fun to unbox it and with my friend Jason so he can see about the Gerard Cosmetics and I thought it would be fun. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so when you open her up, that's what it looks like like this. I believe there were three of them you could have got. This was the medium box. I think this was the, uh, there's one for 39, 69, and uh, I'll leave everything down in the description box, but I do know this was the medium size box. All right, so here's a little sneak peek. Not too much, and I like to tease everybody. The first thing, I'm gonna give this to you, I have this. This is a Dial A Smile Zero Teeth Whitening Pen. Do you use whitening pens? I, I don't use haven't, them. but I know that she does the teeth mm -hmm. whitening. Yeah. And the reason why I can't use it because I have a crown, because right before I got married, I was eating some crabs, this is a true story, and I went like this to bite it, and I was outside, this is when I would drink a beer here and there, you know, and I said, I feel air, like it went like this. And I go look in the mirror, this whole thing was cracked, except for like right here, so it looked like a jagger tooth. Do you know what I mean? Now, I wasn't married yet, so I didn't have insurance. And I begged them at the clinic, please take me in, I need to get my, because how can you take wedding pictures and stuff, you know? So they did, but because I went, now not all clinics are bad, I've had some really good ones, but the clinic that I went to in time where um, they bonded it, it started having like a brown mark right there. And so now that I have insurance, um, what they did was he just redid it, crowned it, and then crowned this tooth to kind of match. So when you have crowns, whitening, even if you professionally get it whitened, it does not work on crowns. Right. So that's why I can't use that, but 
if you want yeah, that. Yeah, I have a bridge on this side, so I just won't use it on the bridge. Yeah, yeah. but you can use it on the front teeth mm -hmm. and all that kind of okay, stuff. Cool. This right here I love. I use this every time I do my makeup. This is the clean canvas. And I always say, I mean, this is really, really good. You should try this too. I don't know what shade this, oh, medium. Um, what this does, I don't know if eye primers, like if, you know, some people use it because they say, oh, it puts the eyeshadow on more pigmented, you know? And I guess that's true. But what I use this for, because I'm getting older, so I get those, sometimes those like wrinkles, you know? And when I put this on, it's like a base. It, like, that's what it's called, clean canvas. But it makes it where, what's the word called? Like, you don't have no wrinkles, it's like a, Smooth? Yeah. <laughs> We're like, huh? Um, and so that's why I like it and I use it all the time. And then I set it because I'm not actually using it to intensify it. You know what I mean? It's really, really good, but I do have, and they last forever because it's like liquidy. So you lean very little, you know, but I love this. My favorite things I um, are in here that I use all the time. And I do have a discount code. It's just Dan in all caps. You can save 30% off. And I, I do. I use this every time I do my makeup. I really, really like it. All right. The next thing are these setting sprays. I always use these too. This is in uh, Dreamsicle. I think this is the one with Rich Lux. He did three of them. I believe this is one of them he created. And... Um, Again, I don't know if this like makes the makeup last longer, but what I use this for when I powder, I spray it, then I take my dampened beauty blender and push it in because then it um, takes away that cakey look. It like melts in your skin. So that's why I use these. So I go through them all the time. Do you use these? I've used one and it burns for some uh, reason. So I don't know okay. if it's just my skin. Could or... be if you have sensitive skin, yeah, yeah so. We have one in Dreamsicle. This is a full size. I think these are like $22. And then, oh, this is their makeup removing balm. I love this. This is in the scent Lavender. Now, when you when you wear makeup, do you, what do you use to take off your makeup? Do you use like makeup wipes or what do you use? Um, I use makeup wipes mostly. Um, I have gotten a couple of the, is it the bombs? I think the bombs were yeah, kind of like using what, the oils. Oh, okay, yeah. These are the bombs. I love this. And I'm not sure if this is the one that has like an exfoliator in it or not, but I have tried this before and I do like it. So I'm glad to get this again. Okay, and then we have a bullet lipstick. If the lighting's bad or whatever, I don't have a ring light. I have one of these like selfie, what are they called? Selfie lights? Yeah, selfie lights. And so I, I, I don't know how it looks, but yeah. This is in the shade nude i like that word <laughs> i don't think i tried her bullets no I, do you I, want this so it looks like that oh it's a pretty color it's a nice color yeah. what when you wear lipstick like what do you like like what colors uh pretty much like neutrals or nudes you know light colors to, yeah to match my lips as best as possible for some reason i always tend to go for like the burgundy right like um brick colors for some mm -hmm. reason and i don't know why i i need to really use lighter sh i don't know why i just always tend to go for like the same color oh and i need to like venture out of your yes yeah. yes because I, I don't know why i do that can i tell a quick little story about mm -hmm. yes. gerard cosmetics yep. um i um had gotten a lipstick from Gerard Cosmetics and some of her the the ones that had the light inside, oh, oh yeah 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 and mm -hmm. the light was broken and I made a comment on Instagram and Jen Gerard actually saw that and contacted me to replace it and I thought that was really cool that you yeah know, Jen Gerard is the owner and founder of Gerard Cosmetics right. isn't she nice she's yeah. so nice and the fact that she did that she didn't have to do that I mean I wasn't like yeah because it's not like you reached out to her she's right. seen the comment yeah. see that there's so many brands that the customer service sucks. Yeah, yeah, but not not dry cosmetics. Do you know who else was really good that I really like? Trend Mood, the Trend okay. Mood box. Mm -hmm. So I did a video of uh, the last video I just did, and it had like a wild cat eye cream. But when I opened it up, there was hardly anything in there. And I never reached out to them. I never reached out to Trend Mood, anything like that. Well, Trend Mood watched my video, and the owner 
had watched it, okay? And that's because I put it on Instagram, like my thumbnail and I tagged, you know, I'm, never thought they'd watch my video. And both of them reached out to me to replace it. Mm. Yeah. And that's nice, you know, you don't see that too often. No, you don't. So I thought that was really, really nice. All right, we have three more things. This is one of her lip creams in the shade Angel Cake. Okay. Really, the blind man, the blind. Oh, yes, and I have my glasses on. There's no excuse for that. <laughs> We've been laughing this way this whole time. I know, <laughs> and it's genuine, you know. <laughs> All right, so see, this is you know, I only use these shades. I'll tell you what, when I do go in with a darker lipstick, yep, yeah, I put it right here like an ombre look, and then I'll put like lip gloss over it. But just to go in like all, I just, I don't know, I don't look right with light colors. Is this the type that you use or is it a little darker? No, I, I think it would be more of like a natural red. Right. You know. Maybe like if you had a lip liner, you know what else I use them? They're lip liners. I'm afraid to use lip liner. <laughs> Why? I can't, get, get over I can't it. draw, I can't even like trace over lines oh. well, so. I'm afraid that it's gonna look really wonky. <laughs> well, you know what's fun? True story. I was vlogging one day. I told you this story, and there was lip. I, I keep lip balm everywhere, like everywhere in my house, in the car, in my pocketbook, everywhere. Okay. So I put lip balm on, and I forgot or didn't realize it was the tinted color, and it was like a pinkish red. So when I put lip balm on, I don't look, because it's lip balm, right? It's clear, so I just go like, you know, I take it and I just do this. So it gets on my skin or whatever, I don't care. It's lip balm, right? And I'm blocking, okay? I happened to, I don't know if I was a red light or whatever, I happened to look in the wind mirror and it was tinted. It was all, it looked like I was doing something I was not supposed to be doing. Yeah. I was, I was, imagine if I went to the store, I was on my way to Home Depot to get some paint, imagine. Well, I wear a mask in the stores, but still, can yeah. you imagine? It was like Miranda scenes, right? Yes, <laughs> I would have been so embarrassed. They'd probably been like, what the hell were you doing before you came? <laughs> yeah. Okay, then this is what I don't like. I don't like the metal ones, the metal mats. Oh. I've never uh, liked those type of lipsticks and stuff. Not on me. This is in a cherry bomb. <laughs> This is like the metallic colors. I don't really care for that. Not for me. Mm. So I'll probably put this, unless you want it, I'll put it in a future giveaway. That sounds like I've been trying to give him stuff all day. You don't want it. I brought some <laughs> bags. I'm like, here, brand new. Cause I have a lot of stuff. He's like, no, I don't need it. I got a lot of stuff. <laughs> because I don't do makeup looks like you do. I got to start doing them. And that's what that looks like. I do think they're pretty, just for yeah. me, I don't think they look right, you know? It's, I guess it's because it's out of my comfort Yeah, that zone, actually you know? is not a bad color, I don't think. Yeah. Instead of swatching like it, you know what I used to do? I used to swatch things, and I'm like, oh, I don't like it, and then I'd have to throw it away. So now it's like, I'd rather not swatch right. it and put it in a giveaway, you know? All right, and the last thing is a highlighter. Now, I think this is a highlighter. Now, let me tell you about the highlighters. This is in the shade Audrey. They're very subtle. They're not like those, if you like those boom, you know, but I'm more into like subtle. I do like though the uh, Ofra because with the Ofras, you can make them, you can build them up, you know, but for like every day, like if I'm not filming, see when I'm filming, I tend to put a little bit more makeup on so that because the light washes you out. But like an every day, like I don't, I, I like the subtle, you know, so these are nice. I think this is the dark shade though. Looks like. Oh, this is the light one. So here is the mirror right here. So I like that that it comes like that. And it says GC. Let me say. Maybe it's a no, this is a highlighter. I don't know what you can see because it's like let's see. Yeah. Do you see how like it's like subtle, but it's also nice? I put it on the wrong hand. It's right here. And that's everything. So let me recap really quickly what came in here. All right, so we have a highlighter. We have a setting spray. I really like these a lot. We have the makeup removing balm. I, I, I really like these as well. 
We have the clean canvas. I'm telling you, these are really, really good. Sometimes my code works on this and sometimes it doesn't, only because it's a newer item. So sometimes, but, but I really would, if I, damn, get that out, man. If I recommend anything, I would definitely say this in the setting spray and the lip liners, but definitely this. Then we have a bullet lipstick. We have a cream lipstick and we have the metal. This is the only thing I'm like, mm, only because I, I just my preference, you know? Right. But do you think that's worth the money? Like for the mystery, would, if you got this mystery box, would you be happy with this? And what was the price one on this? Oh, I oh. know the uh, lowest one was 39. I want to say maybe 59 around there, 49, 50. I'll leave it in the description box. So between, if somebody said 50 bucks, would you think that's worth it or no? Honestly? I, think, I think it is. I think with the products you're getting in this, um, if you added all those products up together. I think it's nice because it's like a mixture, yeah. you know. Um, and if you want to try, that's why I like mystery boxes too. If you don't know what to try, you right. know, I think it's good. But. And with the setting spray, it looks like it's a full size. Thing yeah, that's why that's $22 on its own. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. but yeah, that's everything guys. Don't forget to check Jason's channel out. Trust me, he does talk more. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just a little nervous. Sorry. <laughs> it's the only reason I've been a little quiet. <laughs> and he, trust me, he's not quiet. But um, over on his channel, we're gonna vlog. We're going to, we might go to the boardwalk and vlog a little bit and film. So definitely check his channel out. I will link it down below. And yeah, that's everything. Do you have anything to say? Uh, put you on the spot. <laughs> you put me on the spot, why don't you? <laughs> uh, no, except for I've had a wonderful time I did doing too. this. So um, hopefully there'll be more of these in the future. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> I'm normally not this awkward on camera, I promise. If you watch my channel, you'll realize that. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys, please like this video. It really does help me out or dislike it. That helps me out as well. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this box. Let me know what you think of my boy, Jason. And um, that's everything, guys. Do you know my outro? Stay beautiful. Stay blessed, and most of all, stay you. Stay beautiful. Do you know on my second channel, I always forget my outro. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, stay healthy, and most importantly, always stay you. And I will see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs> Hi, guys. Oh, that was corny. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hello, everybody. Guess, Guess who? <laughs> I'll edit that out. That is bad. Because you're nervous. I said, what do you mean? You're like, oh, I don't know. Who am I? Oh my God. Who am I? Where am I? Oh, Jesus. That made me laugh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, I, I've done a couple vlogs. What are you talking about? <laughs> Which vlog are you referring the, the, to? The park. Oh, Central Park. Yeah, <laughs> Central He's Park. He's done Central Park. <laughs>